So this is what 10 a.m. looks like. Good morning, guys. We've got a yappy little puppy classes on our hands. Well, uh, well, no, that didn't work. A yappy little puppy that has classes today on our hands. And uh, we're gonna get some coffee and get the morning going. And then we're gonna go to work for one, two, one to 10. One to 10. One to 10. One to 10. That works. I need to use my DSLR more. And I'm saying that, but I haven't edited the one that I do have done. I need more people is what I need. I guess that's what I'm saying. Take some spaghetti for lunch today because spaghetti and lunch and today. The plan is later tonight to actually make some music, which we haven't done in forever, but we're gonna do that maybe. Cause Cody might come out and then we're gonna make some music maybe. Let's go to work for now. What's going on? What's going on? Hello there. And on. I got a haircut. <laughs> and a hair and, dye. And a new freshly coated. Freshly coated. Dye of my hair and it was fantastic. They gave me tea and cookies and they're like, is there anything else we can do for you? I'm like, no thanks, that's good. They did like the- Did they give the, you tea and cookies? Tea and cookies, not even kidding. And you know that like weird ass bubble thing that they have in all like those movies and whatever? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. she put me under that. I was just like, ah! <laughs> Apparently it's a hair dryer. I didn't even know. <laughs> I thought it was like a perm or whatever. I thought so too, but apparently it's used mostly as a hair dryer, but then at the same time it's like, Hey, you have really thick hair. Let's let's put you under the little bobblehead thing. So I got pictures of myself doing that. Anyway, the color looks amazing. It does look me. pretty cool. It looks amazing. I it's feel cool. amazing. So amazing. you feel so much like a woman. I feel so pretty. I don't want to put that in. <laughs> yeah, don't. But anyway, so yeah. But yesterday was kind of a, a sad moment when we weren't able to know it. Day before, day before when we weren't able to see day before before we got the comment meter thing. The C M E. Coronal mass ejection. Sun fart. Sun, call it a sun fart. <laughs> Hi Teresa. Two orders. Can I get you? Uh, two orders, please. Look at that man enjoy his donut. <laughs> Have you ever seen a man enjoy his donut more than Evan right now? No, you have not. <laughs> so guys, I gotta admit, I'm not the best at thinking girls in my house at night. <laughs> he gave me something. There you go. I sneak them in to feed them. Andy gave the movie. She hasn't seen it yet. And she needs to see it. Because it's so good. You have to go find these games now. You, it's, it's kind of like shut up and take my money. Is it kind of one of those things? It was awesome. It's such a good movie. It really is. It's like, it feels like, like it's a documentary, but it doesn't actually feel like a documentary. Of course it doesn't feel like a documentary. It's like a documentary about indie games, which it can't be a documentary because it's like indie games are in a mainstream game and therefore hipster. So documentaries can't be hipster. <laughs> I think documentaries in essentially are hipster. Nah. Like, think about the things that are documentaries about, like... Uh, no, no, no. Super Size Me is a documentary, and it was mainstream as balls. You might have a point. You're not even, like, pointing the camera towards me. Yeah, I am. You're, <laughs> you're totally on the other side of the frame. Don't even worry about it. <laughs> Super duper tired. Are you? I am. I'm not. I am. Boop. What the hell is that face? It's my special face. <laughs> okay, it's time to drive me home now. <laughs> okay, fine. All right, guys, I think I'm gonna call that that for tonight. I took Michelle home, we watched the indie game, and then after, and then I took her back to her home place, apartment thingy, and that's uh, that's been tonight. I thought we were gonna record, but I, th I think we're doing that tomorrow. I thought that's what it was the plan, and then I thought like my car was being taken to be repaired. Like I th I thought originally that he was coming out to work on it after work, and then maybe he's actually taking it in the morning, so to work. And I I might have not my car tomorrow. I might have not my car tomorrow. So <laughs> I'm gonna go to bed. I'm gonna leave it at that for tonight, and we will see what tomorrow brings because it's an adventure. It's always a journey, and that's half the fun of it is that we don't know what's going to happen tomorrow 
So we will see you then. Or I will see you then. Or you will see you know what I mean. Good night.